white phosphorus. Attention, the following experiments are for educational purposes only and should not be recreated. Phosphorus is an element which has several modifications. These are all different in their appearance and reactivity. The red phosphorus is one of the less reactive modifications and well known for its use in matchboxes. The white phosphorus is the most reactive modification of all and has to be stored under water. It is often yellow due to small impurities, so it's sometimes called yellow phosphorus. White phosphorus is mainly known because of its use in incendiary bombs, which have been used in the Second World War and the Vietnam War. It is more toxic than potassium cyanide. Even this amount is about five to six times more than the lethal dose. It has a consistency that is similar to wax and can be cut with a spatula. The melting point is at 44.25 degrees C. When exposed to air, smoke is formed that is mainly phosphorus pentoxide. The phosphorus slowly vaporizes on its surface and then reacts with oxygen. The heat that is produced in this reaction can heat up the phosphorus until it ignites by itself. When it oxidizes, light is emitted that can be seen with the naked eye. This is due to chemiluminescence. Even touching it with a hot glass rod causes it to ignite. And sometimes little drops are sputtered which makes the fire unpredictable. When it burns the phosphorus reacts with oxygen to form phosphorus pentoxide. At the end, the phosphorus pentoxide forms a layer that keeps the phosphorus from burning completely, so it is possible that it reignites when touched. This were some of the properties of white phosphorus. I hope you enjoyed. Please rate and comment.